In the United States, roughly 45% of the people over 60, whether male or female, suffer from metabolic syndrome. The cumulative effects of the Western diet are pretty, pretty bad. Another name for metabolic syndrome is visceral fat syndrome. It's belly fat, visceral fat. And it's the fat that accumulates around the intestines uh, deep in the abdomen. So you get the, the classic beer belly kind of look. High blood pressure, high cholesterol, high triglycerides, high fasting blood sugar, and your waist size. You have four out of the five, then you are given that diagnosis of metabolic syndrome. The incidence of metabolic syndrome increases with age. As you put on this visceral fat, the cells of your body become more and more insulin resistant. That's the hallmark then of, of diabetes, type 2 diabetes. And metabolic syndrome is linked to a significant risk of cardiovascular disease. You can avoid metabolic syndrome. I mean, that's, this is an avoidable problem. And so you can avoid it by exercise, by eating right. It's going to take some time to, to fix that. You may not see that overnight. But if you accept that you know, a dietary change, a, di a lifestyle change, then you're, you will see a difference. And you probably see a difference fairly soon. In the last six months, I've lost about 40, 45 pounds. Part of it's exercise, diet. Um, I take the sun chlorella. Now, sun chlorella is a rich supply of these micronutrients. And in addition, because it's a, a very rich in chlorophyll, it provides uh, the benefits of chlorophyll as well. It takes your desire for sugar away, at least for me. And um, you don't have that yearning for it all the time. In fact, you get to the point where you just don't want it. You'll see blood pressure coming down. You'll see cholesterol levels coming down into a, the normal range. You'll see fasting blood sugar coming down into the normal range. It does, it's not, you're not talking years, you're talking probably just a matter of months with, with proper diet exercise and bringing back some of the fruits and vegetables and nutrient-dense foods into the diet. I started feeling better and more energetic. I was reluctant to eat foods that I knew would suppress those feelings. And I, and I think it was all uh, generated from taking some chlorella.